Greetings, welcome back to Aliens Dark Descent. In the last episode, we went to a place called Hunter's Folly. Have a nice day. And our Deputy doctor, Deputy. our medic, Dr. Mac, was severely injured and she lost an arm. So she's had Bye surgery now. and Hello. I think she's going to pull pull through. But um, yeah, she lost her arm. And Operation believe it or not, it wasn't an alien that took the arm. She got into a gunfight and gunfight was the thing that wounded her critically. Understood. Uploading so we're heading back to the refinery. We're going to take a bit more of an experienced team this time. Heading into the facility where our sentry gun was. That is where all the chaos went down. And let's build up the team. We still have a major objective to, to do. So we need to take a much stronger team if we can. And it looks like we, we don't have anyone available. All right, so I was expecting more people to be available for this mission. The kleptomaniac steals supplies at the end of a mission. Well, he's never going on a mission. I don't want that guy. No one steals. Even if you're undisciplined or just bad luck, you still have more worth than a guy that steals from you. Okay, we don't have many options at all. It's going to be a rookie squad, unfortunately. Pretty sure that Sergeant Sharp can hold the boys together. We don't have to fully complete the mission. We can just, you know, push a little bit further in and see how things go play out. Okay, let's go. Um, three rookies. This is going to be a tough one. We'll take as many sentries as we can. Uh, I'll take two, actually, because I've got one there I can pick up when we get there. Bunch of med kits. We're definitely taking extra armor. There, let's go. Let's see if we can have any extra luck. Now, the mission itself wasn't too hard last time. It was just a matter of... Uh, we got cornered straight away, like, just shit hit the fan. Things were going really well, and then out of nowhere, just a swarm of cultists, swarm of aliens, and another swarm of cultists. Wow. What an entrance. Old mate falling gracefully onto screen. Dead. There's our sentry gun that we didn't... I don't think it. we managed to deploy it in time Get during up, the gunfight. And that was the issue. And they came from both sides. They came from, like, literally from both sides. On, it was team. not a very good defensive position at all. But now we have the ARC here, so we're going to make sure that we scope out this area and pick up any supplies that we missed. Because it was a pretty frantic evac straight out after the, the casualty Let's was taken. Inside. Fortunately, we got her out. Although I thought it was cool that she lost a limb and now has a prosthetic arm. I believe this is the room where we found a, a synthetic. That's right, we did. We found a synth in here. And the synth helped us get out. Us. Gave a little bit more fire support. Alright, there's a wave of cultists there. This is what happened to us. We got caught between a wave of these guys and a wave of aliens. And it was the cultists that really... <laughs> Put the pressure on us. Dr. Mac was injured from fighting the aliens. Move on. And then the cultists came in and finished her off. Safe position taken. We'll take a position there. Oh, there we go. The ARC is going to start picking them off. Well, I do think it's a little bit silly that the, even the humans don't respond to the, to the ARC. I mean, it's plausible for the aliens, but not not the dudes patrolling around. All right, we got some supplies in the little There's warehouse here. We did we did not explore that at all there. And where that blip is was a little hive room, infestation room. So no doubt that is a Xeno. 
Yeah, it's a bug room. All right, let's let's try and push forward. I want to explore that room. More signatures spotted. And then we'll head to the primary objective. Not much cover here at all. And he's coming back. Hurry up, squad. We need to get out of the way. Right, so we're just going to have to play peekaboo with this guy. And when he comes through the door, we'll go the other way. If he comes through the door, he'll also get blasted. There he is. Excellent. Right, let's move up into this warehouse. There's a mine that we placed on our extraction and as well as the motion detector. Another alien's already exited that hole. Data pad on the floor, let's get that up. Bukowski, our new uh, recruit, has not seen any action. And Mary and Neron, I believe uh, they had a fight in the mess hall and we had to discipline them. So this is their first mission as well. Sergeant Sharp leading the way. Alright, that alien is in here. Oh, it's a vent alien. That's okay. But that's a that's a real target. Get behind this cover. Oh, it's just a human. On his own, too. We'll target him for... Death. Oh, he's really going to come right up to us. Let's shotgun him in the face. Shotgun out. Just ragdolled. All right, let's get the supplies and let's get on with the mission. So far, so good. Now, I don't think... I don't think I'll go back the way I came. There are a few more targets in that room now. <clears throat> so we'll proceed back to the main entrance where we originally came into this facility. And then we'll push towards... Actually, we'll catch, we'll catch the ARC into the building. Should be on his way. There he is. Let's jump aboard. There's a target patrolling near our mines, just inside the entrance. There's a couple of medikits there that would be very useful, especially with a three rookie squad. It's funny, I sent out a squad last, last mission as a training exercise, and they were more experienced than these guys. So hopefully we don't have a, a situation where we repeat what happened in the last episode. Trying to identify the difference between the alien and the human enemies is providing a a challenge because you have to adopt them different tactics for them all right let's get into this bug room we can't weld this door shut unfortunately there aren't any doors anymore so we'll take these med kits and hope that nothing comes out put a mine here in case something does sensor three uh, sensor sweep once we're ready we'll head out again Oh, we didn't pick up that med kit. That's because we're full? Okay, that's all good. Get back in the truck and we'll proceed further into the facility. There's a bunch of targets on the road, so we're just going to take the transport. These guys do have it a little bit easier. The other team did have to do all this work, opening doors and such. They didn't have the benefit of extra firepower to help them push in. Oh, it's got run over. Literally blind. This thing's like it doesn't exist on the map. <laughs> I 
They should make the whole building out of what they make that APC out of. Alright, there's an armory room. We left some supplies here in anticipation of needing it. So we'll go and stock up. You'll see the motion tracker and the mine that we placed previously. Yeah, this was the camera room. Okay, I, the I, ARC has taken us as far as we can go. Alright. We've got to proceed across a hallway, through a room, up a catwalk towards the objective where that camera is. There are some things to collect along the way. Oh, we have a swarm inbound. We'll just hide up in the camera room for now. Hmm. They have a nice surprise when they walk around the corner and run into the truck. Here they come, marching along. Any second now. Come on, guys. There are dead men walking. Very nice balance between patience and action in this game. I really like it. <laughs> Just marching out to their deaths. Right, set up a mine on an hour advance. Keep moving, keep moving. We've got ammo on the left room. We'll take that. I am anticipating a boss fight. That's why we didn't proceed into this room last mission. So I really need to be prepared for it because these guys aren't experienced. We don't have a huge variety of skills to, to fall back on. Only the Sarge has stuff he can do and he's the bravest of them all. Been stacking bravery buffs on him. I got one target, almost saw us. About to see us again. Creep around the other side. I think this one's a Xeno. Yep. Get into cover. Let's just bomb him. There will do. Oh, blew his leg off. Another one? He hasn't spotted us. Done. But they still launched a hunt. Despite that. It's unfortunate. Oh, we were very loud. And the alien did scream in pain. Alright, quick. Orders are get the sentries up. Facing the door. Make sure these rooms are clear. Pretty sure I swept them before. Yeah, I did. Put up another motion tracker so we can use it as a diversion if we need to. Try and wait out the hunted sequence. I don't really want to get hunted down while we're about to go in to fight a boss. Or a difficult encounter of some description. Been managing the stress. We haven't really been spotted at all. No combat to speak of. The grenades are very useful. In the earlier missions, I wasn't really taking advantage of the range of the weapons, just using the screen distance. And I've since discovered that you can, within the detection radius, they can shoot a grenade across the screen. Same with a sniper rifle. Alright, mines, sentries. We've got a good fallback position. But it is vulnerable to attack. 
got no points left. Let's go and hide. Yeah, we're going to rest. It's not really much on the map. We've got good coverage, but we still have to head over there. And we have to head in there. And then we still have all of this downstairs. Actually, yeah, we need to rest. Otherwise, we're wasting the tool. Put another motion sensor down. So we've got to back up with diversions. And then we'll rest. So we're fully prepared for an engagement. Break the weld. Let's move on. Like this tactic worked really well against the alien queen, the very first alien queen we defeated. We just retreated back through the door. And she followed us and died. Still took sentry guns, mines, and flamethrowers to get her. But if we've got a repeat, it will work. Alright, we're through the door. What do we have? Oh, there's that creepy machine back guy. What's he doing? Praying praying to the queen it's pretty gruesome stitched together like Frankenstein oh nice beautiful oh he's got an alien inside him what is that why the heck would you want that done to you his arms are very alien like Oh, he's one of them, is he? Ooh. Okay, let's go back. Oh, the door's locked. They're on to me. All right, we need to get some suppression down. Slow these Xenos down. Drop a grenade on them. Excellent, splat him, very good. Where is he there? Let's drop a grenade on him and just splat him. No, he's not dead. He's way more resilient than the average human. We got runners inbound. We're out of command points. We just have to target the aliens. We've got no points. We've just got one back. We need to just kill this guy with a grenade. Well, we're locked in here now. But that wasn't as hard as I expected. Search for the keycard. Are they mad enough to host one of those creatures? We got that pass. You reckon it'll work with that locked elevator you mentioned earlier? Sure. If it was built by the Wayland Yutani, it should. Right. Let's head for that elevator then. Time to reach that basement. Okay, what's in here? We found the prisoners, Sergeant. Good. Ask all the questions. We need more intel. Oh, we Relax, got prisoners. Guys, we're okay. USCM. You're all safe, but I need to know what happened here. I, I think they're called the Darren era, lunatics. They asked about our genes. We got separated. My family. They took them to their temple. Oh God. I hope they're okay. You need to help them, please. Easy, easy. How about you? Why did they keep you here? I don't know. They took our blood and locked us in here. Told us we'll be lucky enough to meet Cassandra. Be part of her great project. Wait, what did he just say? Pretty sure I heard Cassandra, Chief. Huh. Old school name. I hope she made her parents pay for it. Keep your trap shut, Hunslet. Marines, get these civilians back to the ARC now. Right, we've got... Some civilians Roger. to rescue. 
bunch of supplies. That's good. Okay, um, we've got to head back to the ARC, but it's on our way to the basement, I believe. The elevator was locked off near the entrance to the facility. It's pretty close. Yeah, we'll call it there. Rather than walk back through that room, we'll go north. Come on, team! Hurry up, you slugs! Okay. All right. How do we get out of here? We've got to go back in the, go out back out the way we came in. Use the key card on this console. Right All right. Mission's going very well. Very well. Pick up the sentries, and then peel out. There's an option to upgrade them. That's cool. Keep pushing forward once the sentries are picked up. We do have two civilians with us now, so we have to be careful. There's the ARC. It's just arrived just in time. We've just got to make it up this hallway, and we're home free. <clears throat> once the civilians are secured, we will then move over to the other side of the, the, uh, the facility. Some ammo here. We'll grab that. We are safe. Got fire support from the ARC. Alright, moving on. Let's get these civilians out of here. And they can join the crew of the Otago. Extracting survivors now. Excellent. Two new members for the crew. Let's redeploy to the other side of the facility and get down that elevator. We've all leveled up, so all of our rookies have got enough experience to level up. That's fantastic. So it's now it's just a nice, safe ride to the other side. We're just clipping through the doors there. See, that's what I mean. It, this thing doesn't exist on the map. Once you're in it, you are invincible. Like I said, if you've got a whole fleet of these, you'd win the alien invasion easily. Arriving in typical US Colonial Marine fashion. Loud. Can't loot that because we're fully stocked with med kits. No tools though. So we don't have much in the way of tactical options for repair or hacking. Somebody in that room, so we'll move the truck up and he can go and intercept. The guy's coming down the road. There's a whole wave of them about to get mown down. Heavily wounded Marines, yep, we already know about that. We save them the hard way, we learn the hard way. Get the console unlocked. Couple of explosive barrels there, so I need to be careful. ARC took care of those cultists for us. Oh, it's one of the tough ones. It's one of the tough ones. Let's go in. It's a crazy Xeno wielding one. There we go. Hopefully we can get him with a barrel too. Oh, he just moved. Just moved. But he's dead anyway. Good job. Besides that, the room is clear. Where are the exits? There's a welded door there. Put a mine there in, anticip in anticipation of opening it later. Should I open it now? Oh, that's where the elevator is. We have to go that way. Is this the elevator? No, this is the room. All right, let's crack the weld and proceed. Set up a trap room. Excellent. 
Excellent work. Let's move on, Marines. Sharp is leading a very tight operation. Despite having some of the negative traits being undisciplined and bad luck, we, we're doing very well. Set up some sentries just in case. Just a retreat, retreat room. More supplies, more, t oh, we've got some tools now, that's good. Our medikits are full. There's a breakable wall there. And also a console. Just mark that door. So it looks like possibly some kind of locker room. Yeah, locker room, bathrooms. And then that goes out to the main entrance, does it? It does appear so. Okay, so that's how we get to the main area. So we'll call back the ARC and we've got a very, very close extraction then. More supply crates. Check out the shower room. Couple of bodies. Oh, that's not a breakable wall, it's an actual door. Unlock this and we've just got a straight jump outside. Or should I open this one? Another one sacrificed to the pulse cannons. All right. Wow, a just big blob just spawned near our sentry guns. Let's go and collect the guns. If they get destroyed, that that's very big waste of tools to fix them. Plus, if we're going to go down into the basement, we're definitely going to need them. Team very efficient. And we'll shore up those defenses with the extra mines. All right, let's proceed. Get downstairs into the basement and see what we can find. Oh wait, we have not secured our exit yet. In case we have to leave fast. And the locker room can be a backup restroom. Literally. Okay, so if things go really wrong in the basement, we will exfil to the locker room for a rest. If things are really bad, we go straight out to the ARC. It's working. Stay alert, Marines. We don't know what we'll find in that basement. All right, let's push forward. Come on, team. Drawing out the tactics a little bit, but I'm trying to be very careful. I do not want to lose a rookie. I don't want to be responsible for losing another limb. The way it worked out last mission is our most experienced Marine was the one that got targeted. Look at that. These guys are nuts. Okay, big pile. Guess we found that poor guy's family after all. Is there a girl in there? Anything more specific while we're at it, Sarge? She'd be uh, in her teenage years. Blue eyes. And a nose like mine. Let me guess, your daughter. <laughs> Just need to make that hint very obvious. Right. Oh, 
Uh oh. Uh oh. What is that? Is, is that a Praetorian? Like Hive Guard or something along that line? Usually they don't. Do Whoa, that. he's right Focus there. Brains. That critter's different, but no less dangerous. Find these containers before it finds us. It. Did it just go, yeah, whatever, bros? <laughs> Does it know I'm there, or is it a boss? What? Fight! Put the. I'm gonna put the sentry guns up. Three line sentry guns, so we can just go straight back to. Sentry almost ready. Come on, team! It just fully right walked now. away. Hurry up, squad! Planting mine. Watch your feet. Sentry activated. Was that intentional? Was it literally just showing off to us? Like, if you come in here, I'm going to eat you. Or was the mission supposed to trigger a little bit earlier than that? Before we were right next to it. No matter. Let's find the data pads, clear the room, hey, in case it comes back. Something. Looks like a data pad. Let's see what's inside. Hmm. A little bit apprehensive now. It's got me worried. On it. We'll take one of them with us. Packing sentry gun. But we'll still leave this here so we have got a fallback position. Chuck Deploying up a motion, a track. motion tracker. Sentry packed. If it really hits the motion fan, track, we track. could use that as a trap to lure all the Move aliens on. to this kill zone. Turrets and mines. Alright, let's push forward. This is the way that this large alien went. I'm pretty sure it's called a Praetorian. Like they become the queen or something if... If there's no queen around. Another data pad. We have contact in the next room, but there's no obvious way how to get there yet. That door hey, is locked. Something. Looks like a data pad. These you can't go down there. Love their trains. They probably use those rails to move the containers around. We follow them. We find the crates. Okay. There's a Come big on, dot team. in there. I'm guessing that's him. Well, that's got to be him, right? Or is that just teasing us to say, "Hey, at the end of this level, you're gonna have to fight that thing." I'm not gonna take any chances. We will take chances because we're in They're this building. <laughs> Hurry up, squad. All right, let's get over to the trigger. The enemy is trying to stop you with explosives. Stay alert. Oh, shit. So we've got to watch out for bombs, too. We have two contacts. I can't see him. Oh, it just looks like a normal Xeno. Okay. Let's proceed, then. Tension, tension lowered just a little bit. We can skirt across the outside of this room, over here, Move on. and in through that door. Didn't see us. Not quite visible, somewhat visible. There's an alien. Copy. Let's see what's inside. Should I uh, see? We have to sort of go back out there anyway. Like the north. The north door still take sorry, the south Hurry southern up, door what? still takes us around in the same area. Suppressive fire! He's coming in. Er, flare Shh. shotgun. Hey, oh hey. shit, that is the big one. It's the big one. It's the big one. Take him straight ahead. Take him down. He uh he retreated. Hoorah. He retreated. But he's waiting outside the door. Um, we're gonna have to skirt our way around the edge. Holy shit, he's right there. Um, we'll grab a sentry, chuck it up. Deploying sentry gun. Hopefully he doesn't just charge through. Sentry almost ready. Waiting for us to get complacent. More signals incoming. Sentry activated. Okay, let's Come trigger on, the door. Shit, the thing's off. There he is. Light there he up. is. Get away from him, use a shoddy. 
talking about? Very close Rocky. to us. Disgusting. But he didn't seem hyper aggressive. He was sort of just dawdling around. Alright, we've got more targets inbound. Let's move out. We harvested a sample of this new alien type. Safe position taken. Let's keep moving forward. Incoming. Let's see what's inside. It's a Is drone. That, that thing in here with us, almost. More signals incoming. Just slightly out of sight, so we're going to skirt around the edges. Drone spotted. It's a drone. Okay. We're getting ourselves pretty deep into the More nest now. Spotted. And I've left my sentry gun behind. Just to cover that door. I'm wondering though, we, we on, kind team. of need it. That might not be the last, like, large alien that we fight. Hurry up, you slugs! We're also not far off of a onslaught. Deploying motion tracker. We get seen once or twice more, we may be in trouble. Setting up motion tracker. Motion tracker activated. Make this a kill room? No, we'll way. take the sentry. Packing sentry gun. It's just going to be it's going to be our diversion. Sentry packed. Alright, let's move up around the edge of the map. Hopefully we can find some access that's not guarded. There's a a hole right there. Something's probably going to come out if we're not careful. Come on, team. Let's keep moving around. More signals incoming. Got a barricade here. We have more than enough ammo. On my way. Let's blow it up. Actually, wait. There's someone there, and that will call him. But he is on the other side of the barricade, I think. Yes, he is. Can we call him away? Or is he trapped in that room? I have multiple signals. Yeah, he's trapped in that room. Okay. We're going to have to breach. I'm just concerned that an onslaught will happen and we'll be unprepared for on it. My way. Come on, team. Get down, it's gonna blow. Double time. Safe position taken. Let that blow. Thankfully it didn't attract him. So let's get in here quickly. Clear and sweep the room. Get through the next door before he comes back. Put a mine there in case he does start an advance back up Planting the hallway. Watch your feet. This room seems Mine's to be clear. Alright. Looking good, looking good. Let's just get through here. Nothing to catch us from behind. Let's do it. Let's move on and get into this. So we just squad right. <laughs> but I don't want to ruin it for you. Bring him down. Watch out, here come the spidery ones. That was the first time that I've had to reload. Or loss. A soldier. In fact we lost all of them. But here we go. Bunch of face huggers coming in. Mine's bigger. Suppressive fire! Bunch of aliens. Let's move down the walkway. Check your vitals, squad. We didn't even make it this far before. This is my second attempt. Right now. Let's see what's inside. Looks like they found us. Incoming. Alright. Mow them down. Got a good field of fire up. Oh yeah. It smells good. Now we need to hit the stress reliever. Let's see what's inside. Pick up this ammo. We went from 10 magazines to 7 very quickly. A 
Stress is pushing up on all of them. We're about to tick over to an onslaught. It's coming to us. Hit the nap relief. Hit the nap relief. And keep moving. Don't. There's another one. Ah, oh, shit. Here comes the onslaught. There's two more Xenos coming towards us on the on the radar. And the onslaught is coming from that same direction, so we need to set up the sentry gun. Sentry almost ready. Sentry activated. All right. There's not much we can do, but just try and hold out. Reload. Make sure everyone's got fresh mags. Here it comes. Uh, we need to throw a flare out. Let there be light. And then it's just a matter of hoping that we can hold them off. Here they come. Looks like six to seven. It's not very big. Here we go. Slowing them down with the suppression and the accuracy is really helped. By the flare. There we go. Nice effort. Seems like they're coming down. We did it. Everyone gets an extra XP. Packing sentry gun. Come on, team. They're heading our way. Sentry packed. Someone's coming from behind, I think. Well, they stationary. Ambush aliens. We're clear. Let's harvest That's some disgusting. samples. That pays for our armor in this mission. Got them. They look intact to me. Here's your sample. I have multiple signals. Couple more coming. Suppression, Shit. just keeping it up. Shit, get over here. Light them up. Tango down. Oh, that's this pushed us into another combo. hunt. Another hunt. This could end up being a Contact. aggressiveness Contact. cycle if we're not careful. Oh, the runner got him. The runner got him. Shotgun. Oh, we missed. He dodged. Shotgun. More. Oh, these are cultists. Crazy cyborgs. Grenade. Grenades are super effective against humans. Oh, he dodged that perfectly. He's right in the center. Fortunately, we didn't take much damage from Copy. any of that. Hey, I found something. Looks like a data pad. Uh, we're about to encounter a move, move. a large alien if we're not careful. Let's see what's inside. Tension's getting a little bit high. I think what we're going to do is we're going to pull out. We'll pull back to our retreat room on the first floor. See how this goes through here first. Check your vitals, squad. I do not want to lose these guys. Before the whole team got wiped out. Stay alert. The crusher's roaming around. Oh, we've got a crusher now. Before the whole team got wiped out, and this game doesn't continue if you right squad now. squad wipe. So if you lose one to three marines. It continues, but if you lose everyone, it's just you have to reload. We got shrekt by face huggers. Okay, get the nap relief out, I think. Yep. We've got more than enough medical supplies, and I know there's more upstairs. Okay, we've got a room here to explore. But let's open up this door, and that'll give us access back to the entrance. Back to the elevator. Got something on the tracker. Some ammunition. We'll leave that for now. Hurry up, you slugs! Yep, we're going to head back to the restroom. The locker and restroom. It's going to extend the mission a little bit, and I might actually leave that video when we get to the locker room um, and then do the rest of the mission in the next video. 
I want to try and keep the videos around 45 minutes to an hour max. And there's no telling how much longer this mission's got. On it. Pick these up. Packing sentry gun. We're going to use those further on, I think. Sentry packed. All right. Yeah, we've got two large rooms to explore. And I think we have to get our way back. Do I dare or do I go and rest? Keep to the plan. Let me know what you want down below. Either way, I'm going to do what I want. <laughs> yeah, we have to go around there. Don't get too comfy. Through that door. Okay. There's a hackable door there. And then into a main a main Let's room. Do what we came for and get the hell out of here. There is a restroom there, but it requires going back in and facing these aliens. Move on! I think it's safer for us to go back to our pre-planned room. On it. All right, back up to the first floor. If we've planned this correctly, it should be very secure run to the restroom. It's a couple, couple of doors down. There's our medical supplies to top up what we used in the form of nap relief. Shit, it's coming to us. They're heading our way. Nah, we're not worried about those. We have more than enough coverage. Then step into the restroom. What is that big blob doing? They're outside. I thought they might have been in the hallway. Great I thought our hallway was compromised, but that's not the case. Move on. All right, rest time. Away. If you're enjoying the series so far, make sure to leave a like down below, hit subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you in the next part of the operation. I'm trying to upload these videos every 12 hours or so, so if you're watching them as they come out, they won't be long. Until then, Commander Tyrael, out.